reopening of the M2 motorway today. Could you maybe just give us a little bit of background on why it was closed and what some of the work actually entailed during the rehabilitation? You know, uh, sometime last uh, August, uh, I was invited by GRA management and the MMC of Transport, MMC Makuba, that they were concerned uh, with the structural uh, uh, state of uh, some of the bridges on this particular freeway. And I was actually brought to this particular one. And um, given on a tour, a few days later, then invited the press to show them why I've taken a decision because I immediately announced that I left to unfortunately close this bridge because unfortunately the state was such that uh, accident would happen at any time. And I'm really grateful that I took that decision, proud of the work that uh, GRA has done because uh, you remember we closed the westbound uh, in August and January, February this year we had to close uh, the now the eastbound as well because we discovered further uh, challenges uh, further on this freeway and uh, here we are uh, a few months later we're here opening it Monday 5 36 o'clock this freeway will be open again to, uh, to our residents uh, this uh, freeway as you are aware it's uh, in it ad arterially that supports uh, the heart of the economy of, of this country because Johannesburg is the economic heart of South Africa. So taking that decision was a very, very difficult. It was one of those most difficult decisions for anybody to take, but fortunately enough, it was necessary. And uh, here we are today to open. And I think I'm really so grateful to GRA because what they did while they were repairing the bridges, took advantage of resurfacing the bridge, I mean the, the road. As you can see, we did not just uh, uh, resur uh, the, the deal with the bridges, we've now resurfaced the, the, the entire stretch of, uh, of, of, of the M2. 